Totally. What you're worried about is, was this spirit who was talking to you really your life? Oh, here's you. Here's the spirit. Was this spirit really your guide? You already know the answer, actually. Was it really your guide? What do you feel? What's the... You think it was. But let's go with your feelings. What do you feel? I guess if I am questioning it, then it can't be right. Otherwise, I would just have a sense of Yeah, it was a spirit in not a bad place coming to you, claiming to be you. Sorry? Yes, because he knows that's the terminology you use for it. Yeah. But, like, I was talking to a friend of mine a few weeks ago. He said there's two spirits here from the 20 second sphere. Okay, oh, are yeah. you? Um, they're both women. Oh, interesting. Okay. Is there any women in the 20 second sphere? Is there any men in the 20 second sphere? No, not past 20 first. The 20 second sphere, remember I said, I've said to you, is the soul union condition. So, will you feel the spirit from that location as a gender? No. No. Okay. Interesting that they told you that that's where they were from. Anyway, we started talking to them. Through him, he, he talked to them. And I started talking about their emotions. Their emotions were, they were attached to this man because he, he looks after women, this man does. And they felt attracted to him. Because, why do you reckon they were attracted? Because they wanted looking after. Right? And I actually talked to them and eventually we talked and they were in the first sphere. But they used all the terminology they could to, because they can read his mind of course. They used all the terminology they could to convince him they were in the 20 second speed. But if he allowed himself to feel his emotions like I did at the time, he would have known they were attracted to him for reasons that wouldn't be there if they were in the 20 second sphere. Right. But isn't the loving thing to do to hear is to hear that person out here? Totally. But, but let's, let's call it as it is. They're lying to you, misrepresenting the truth to you, so let's address that with them. So let's you need to address that with that spirit. Now, why does it want to misrepresent the truth to you? What's going on? Can you help him? Trust your own feelings about the matter. Does that make sense? Yes. 